Uh, we're here today to do a training video on the new Green Mech Evo 165. On a new 165, routinely, you will find in the document box on the side here, your safety ball, your ownership manual and maintenance record, and the operator's manual. This will include technical drawings, risk assessments, parts manuals and everything. This is the Roto diesel version. There will also be a tracked diesel version and a petrol 37 horsepower V-twin version. But today we've got the diesel version, uh, Roto. It's a standard trailer format, so to remove it from the towing vehicle is the same as any other trailer. We're on a slightly uh, nose downhill attitude here, so we'll put the handbrake on, drop the jockey wheel down, remove the light fittings, Put them back in the holder there. Remove the brake safety cable. Tuck that out of the way. This one's locked onto the car, so we'll use the correct key to undo the trailer hitch. Lift up the button, tip the handle forwards, and wind up the jockey wheel until it's securely off the vehicle. All Green Mech wood chippers come with the new safety ball. It's a safety feature or a theft prevention device. You lock it into the ball hitch when the machine isn't attached to the vehicle and it will prevent an opportunist from hooking it onto the back of their car and driving off quickly. To fit the safety ball, press it into the cup, wait till the indicator pops up and the handle comes down and then using the key on the barrel lock, lock the handle. So you can't lift the handle up any further than that and the ball won't come out the bottom and it'll prevent an opportunist thief from running away with your machine. Standard features include a, an indicator there so that when the ball is fully in, that pops up to show you're in the right position and a green slice there just to show that the handle is in the right position too. Once you've got it hooked up to the lorry, attach your, your safety cable elsewhere on the towing vehicle. That is designed to pull on the handbrake if it gets separated from the vehicle. The height of the handbrake under ordinary conditions gives you a good idea of the state of your brakes. That's fine, if it starts to come right back here, you know it's having to put a, pull a yard of cable through before the, the shoes are effectively hitting the drums. If you're running multiple vehicles, the 165 is fitted up with a bungee corded removable cable. If you've got a mixture of vehicles with the new type connection and also the old type connection, it's very easy to swap them over. and then you can connect that to the vehicle without yards of cord around, wrangled around your jockey wheel or potentially dragging on the road. Evo keys comprise three separate keys. You've got a black one which is the ignition key and then two very similar looking keys. One with 701 is for the fuel tank locking cap and the other key is for the bore hitch. This is the Green Mech Evo 165 Roto machine. It's available in two options. You have the 25 horsepower four-cylinder Kubota water-cooled diesel and you also have the V-twin Vanguard 37 horsepower petrol engine. 